Since I was looking up some waterfalls and some things to do around Ricketts Glen, I've come across this secret waterfall trail, I guess you could call it. It's not really a trail, it's more like you're blazing your own way and you're climbing up waterfalls and it's about an eight and a half mile loop. Um, so I just went into town real quick and on my way back, I found one of the first waterfalls. Um, so you came down, I right, came down this road here. It's just a real narrow one way dirt road. Real sketchy if another car is coming, which another one did. There is a cabin up there called Sullivan Falls Camp. Okay. <clears throat> Not too sure what the camp is all about. I don't see anybody there. There is a little parking lot right here, as you can see. Okay. So that's where I parked here. Now for the main parking, I don't know exactly where it is. <clears throat> um, to actually do the trail it's it's pretty hard to research and find from what I found I did find some maps and everything but it takes some time to really do some of the search um, but so far all I really found was this was Sullivan Falls and I, I mean look at this it is absolutely gorgeous oh my gosh This is unbelievable. There are ways to get down there. I guess you gotta climb down these rocks. I'm not about to, cause if I get hurt, I'm by myself. And there is absolutely no cell phone service here. So I'm not even gonna take the chance. That view right there alone is, is perfect for me to take some photos. But it just goes on and on. There's about, I think seven or eight waterfalls total in this loop trail that you could do. There's Twin Falls, Sullivan Falls, Big Run Falls, some unnamed falls, um, and then you just Pigeon Run Falls, and you just kind of, like I said, follow the creek, and then you meet up with a trail again, and then you follow the creek again. But it, it's, it's pretty strenuous and difficult from what I hear, and definitely not recommended to do by yourself. But I just wanted to show you this real quick, because like I said, I just came, in, came back from into town, and I was going back to my campsite. And I mean, this is just beautiful. This totally made my day. And then there's a small little path here. Now again, I have not been down here yet. But just listen. Man, that sounds awesome. Super excited. Oh my God. Wow. Wow. Now supposedly there's switchbacks to get down here. Wow, oh yes, there's the switchback sound. Oh my gosh. This is incredible. Very, very slippery. Again, this is not really like a trail. Man, oh man, look at that. That is gorgeous. Oh, there's somebody down there photographing now. Wow. So quick, so I've just made it down. That crazy descent. And, uh, it wasn't easy. <laughs> the switchbacks are kind of just man-made and you have to hold on to branches and trees and things like that. It's not easy at all. But I'm down here with another photographer. He's actually pretty cool. I was just talking to him a little bit and uh, kind of giving each other a little tips on how to shoot and where we're from and things like that. Really cool guy. Uh, he's actually crossing the creek now, but let me show you the reward that you get for hiking down, something like that.
absolutely incredible. So again, this is Sullivan Falls here. The first one I went to was uh, Big Run Falls. Absolutely spectacular. I'm just gonna give you the secret how to find this place. It's on Old Sullivan Road, when you're coming down 487 South towards Ricketts Glen. Right before the state park parking lot, you, where you turn left, you would actually turn right onto this old dirt road. Old Sullivan's Road has a private driveway road. You stay to the left of that, you follow the old dirt road and then you'll come and you'll see these waterfalls. It's absolutely amazing. Check it out when you can if you ever get a chance to. This is, a, this is great. I'm gonna stay here for a little bit and just enjoy it, talk some more with the other photographer, and uh, probably go back to the campground. It's starting to rain and drizzle a little bit, but man, this is, this is something else. This is beautiful. <laughs> So I'm all done shooting. Um, I talked to that guy somewhere, Ken. Super nice guy. Really fun to talk to. Enjoyed his company. Actually glad I was here, or glad he was here while I was here, uh, just for safety reasons. I mean, you can see, that's the way I came. And then you gotta walk down, and then right where he's walking. I mean, it's, it's no joke. Definitely uh, gotta know what you're doing. It's not an easy hike. Um, you gotta hold on to some roots. Make sure you got the proper footwear. Uh, my battery's about to die. But man, I mean, just look at that. One more time. Sullivan Falls, what a beautiful sight. And I guess people have rock jumped from the top right corner there. Uh, you gotta jump out a little far, but uh, it's deep enough to, to fall in. But man, what a sight to see. Absolutely enjoyed it. Got some beautiful photos. Um, pardon me if this is gonna be shaky, but you can see there ain't nothing holding me up if I were to slip and fall. So, I'm actually gonna go up this way. And we're actually heading up there. But again, I mean, this is no joke. One slip and, and you're done. So, slow and steady, three points of contact, contact, you know, two feet in one hand, two hands in one feet, something. Always make sure you're, you're touching something with three points. But, this is what I'm talking about though, I love coming to the places that are off the unbeaten path. I mean, the less touristy attraction. And I mean, no, people don't really get a lot of these same shots. I mean, yes, there was a guy here, but I mean, the only way you can really find this out is just by exploring. I mean, this is on an old dirt road, in the middle of nowhere, no cell phone service. And I mean, people just find this stuff just by exploring and word of mouth. So Sullivan's Falls, absolutely amazing. Enjoyed it. The weather held out, it was kind of sprinkling a little bit, but you know what? That, that kind of sets the tone and the mood a little bit. You know, the mist, the eeriness, it's fall, it's October, you know, Halloween time. It really, really sets the mood and the dramaticness, and it really, really gets you pumped up for a good adventure. Um, so, coming back to the parking lot here. Again, my battery's about to die. Um, 
Loved it though. Gotta come back. Definitely gotta come back again. Man, this was just beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Again, you come down that old dirt road. Okay. Come down that old dirt road. You'll see Big Falls on your right. They'll have a small little uh, pull off there. And if you keep coming down, they'll have a big parking lot here with some trees and a little roundabout. As you can see, you pull in here and then you can roundabout up and so forth. But it's just absolutely spectacular. Loved every second of it. Can't wait for tomorrow. Tomorrow's Ricketts Glen. Um, looking, really looking forward to that. And I'm gonna have to come back here and, and check out some more waterfalls and stuff. So, until then, we'll see you on the next trip. <laughs> so far, this is this is starting out to be an awesome trip.